A group of teens in Independence, an Independence High School choir, has really struck the right chord. This Memorial Day, they'll be performing at the world-famous Carnegie Hall. We caught up with these incredible voices before they took off early this morning. Success doesn't come from things done occasionally. Success comes from things done consistently. And because of their success, Truman High School Choir is ready to walk into Carnegie Hall and put on a show. Carnegie Hall in New York City. This choir is special because of what resides right here in their heart. This group. We've worked pretty dang hard to get to this point. For rising singers like Ethan McCauley and Daniela Mendoza, it started about a year ago when the group received a personal invitation to perform. It's Carnegie Hall. Like that's that's a once in a lifetime opportunity. And if I get the choice to go there, God, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it in a snap. When you see people professionally singing at places like Carnegie Hall, you know, you don't expect high school students to be doing that. And the fact that we get to do that at our age, it, I think it's incredible. As I'm packing last night, I'm thinking two words. Oh, wow. Are you thinking, oh, wow? Because literally, like 18 hours, it's going to be like, oh, wow, this is happening. On the choir room chalkboard is a map of the Big Apple. And this Memorial Day, Truman High School will be put on the map for all to see. And above all, here. We performed this in Hamilton, and we sang... And then this whole table over goes, oh, wow. <laughs> so the first two notes, I need you to think, oh, wow. And then it'll sound like that. When I came and joined Truman's Choir, I don't know, I felt like my voice meant something. I, I felt like I could be heard here. I can tell you what, after hearing them perform, it gave me goosebumps. They are great. Over the past few months, the choir raised more than $155,000 to make that trip possible. We wish them all the best as they perform Monday at Carnegie Hall.